Got to get the sign, see what it says. Or do you think that people should have the right to, to kill? I just want to know. Are you, are you, are you agree with Hitler that you know, we should have the right to kill certain people off? Well, isn't that what the choice is? The choice to kill? I mean, just answer my question, okay? I mean, you, that, I mean, you I respect the right to a, choice. I don't believe that that is a fair depiction of what choice means in the context of what this oh, is. Oh, okay, well, then, well, then what are you talking about choice? You're not talking about abortion? This is the point of my sign here, is I'm not going to feed, feed you on that point. I'm just not. Well, well what's a troll? Why, why should you not feed the troll? Well, what's a troll? Because the way that this discourse is handled right now in, I just in these situations, I know, that's, that's perfectly fine. So here's what I'm going to say. The issue with the way that the discourse is handled, what you're coming to this conversation with and what I'm coming to this conversation with are, at the moment, you're operating under a system of logic that is not compatible with my system of logic. Which so I'm not... That women's bodies are their control, and that there are circumstances and ways of signifying a good life other than just being alive. Like, that is not, like... The, you can there, have a the, good life if you're dead? I'm going to say that... I'm just asking questions for you to explain yourself. No, you, I'm you saying have it's a sign different. Here. No, if but you your, your definition of my what side, life, but your, it. your, what you call life... That's I think a, that you have a very sim what you have you a very that? black and white definition of what life is, what and is the life? complexities and the choices that go into a choice that I'm talking about, and I don't think it's fair. So I'm not going to engage you because you set up a system that is designed like we're we're, we're working with mutually exclusive logics and mutually like. Logic can't be mutually exclusive. Yep. Logic is always logic. There's no, laws no, of logic, this right? A, this is a problem. There's lots of logic. You're correct. You do understand, like, but the laws of non-contradiction, <laughs> the, the rules of logic. No, but that's Western logic. That is a very no. specific it, line of logic. I'm just so, going to tell you that where logic is in study logicians and people that study logic, mm -hmm. they're going to tell you that if you're going to actually talk about logic, you need to admit that there are at least four major problems with them. One of them is the idea of mutual, ex like, exclusion. Like, you can't, like, that is... One of the so you believe that so you believe that you don't believe in a you don't believe in solid forms of logic you don't believe no, that I don't I believe in solid forms of logic I just believe that there are different ones let, that are well, operating clearly because we can't have a conversation well let's I'm just go a conversation with you well, you're sure having we, a conversation with me well sure we can I, we are, this is a conversation what we're I'm asking is what is we're having we're well, using English but I'm saying sure. that the forms of logic and that are operating are different so I'm not going to feed you I'm not going to argue because we're well different. that's I'm that's here feeding. To support I'm Those signs are feeding. I'm people that read eat. Other people. Okay. I'm here to support other people and warn them because okay. this is the kind of violence that I don't want to see represented on my I, campus. I surely don't want to see that represented in and this country. <laughs> Definitely. And that's that's happening no, every day. See, right here, you're enacting a different form of violence. I'm saying that obviously... This is, this is violent? Yes. You're standing with a sign. We're, we've got a sign and you're we're violent. violent. You're not violent. No. Okay, do you realize that you can be contradicted in that by saying you are approving, but you are talking about abortion. That is a sign of ovaries. That is a reproductive system. You're a, you're saying if a woman has a choice to do that, then I could easily say back to you that you are a, you are approving killing babies, and that's violent. I mean, that's, that's simple. That's sort of a slippery slope kind no, of fallacy. Not. Yeah, because you're saying that everyone necessarily will have to make this. That having a choice does means that. that that's what, just that's just what I'm advocating. just explain yeah. your sign. Do you believe a woman has a right to abort her child? No, that, see, that's the problem. I'm saying. That so what does that mean? Choice, then explain that, that choice. That choice means that they that they have autonomy over their body. That they. Okay, that child is not their body. It has different chromosomes. It has a different. It has a different structure. It has a different. Um, a whole different DNA makeup. You do know that, right? Ninety-eight percent of DNA across people is the same. Like just to let you know, the variations are pretty fucking small, but. That's a whole other point. Like, I'm just... Well, we're all human. But I'm saying, you're being very contradictory because you have a thing about choice. What are we? What choice are we respecting? Well, so then here, I'm going to throw that back at you and say that, you know, your right to life here... Sure. Your right to life here sometimes endangers and threatens the lives of mothers and of the children. What about instances where children are so, so, like, the chances of them 
being able to like function and operate. I'm not saying it's right, but to function and operate in our society. Okay. Now, now just just remember, just recognize what you're saying. You're dealing with mathematics right now. You just moved into the realm of mathematics, right? You're saying you're saying you just said you said the chance of chance deals with mathematics. Chance deals with percentages. The percentage of that child who is torn apart and killed has zero percent chance at life. Every child that is born has some percentage of having a productive and powerful life and good life. Isn't that not true? Is that not just pure statistics? Because you can't guarantee that any child born in any situation is going to end up being in a horrible situation. No, the I statistics are. I can point to systemic inequality. But you cannot. But you. But you have to admit that if you give a person a right to kill the child, like is in that picture, that child has 100% no chance at getting anything productive. Right? Because they're dead. That's just simple stats. Your your lo You don't have a good logic because when you deal with the real world. Real, the real world, your logic you, is flawed. But you guys are, you're, you're talking about the real world, but yes. part of your justification. That's a real baby. Your justification and your thing is, is the Bible and like yeah. all these other, like how can, like, that's a, the Bible, the Bible's I, never been disproven. The Bible's completely to perfect. And I want to like alert people that are walking through. Sure. That they're about to see pictures comparing women to fucking Hitler. Uh -huh. So I think that's. Actually, you know who said that? That said Martin Luther King Jr. said that. It's his quotation. That's and what really he's saying great. is... You have Martin Luther King. Like, he's Jr., perfect. Yeah. Like, no. no. Martin Luther King Jr. Like, he is a perfect person. No. I, like, I think I'm just saying that... Things, but, like... All we're saying is that is that... On all of these, like, well, it, it's a simple logic statement. That picture says that is legal. And since that's legal in this country, and that's genocide of our own people, then... It is logic that just because it's legal, you can kill. That was Hitler's logic. It was legal. He was voted into office. He could legally kill it. It's it's not. It is not. It's not an improper logical equation. It's a pure logic equation. It's simple. But you're, what I was asking you, and you won't give me a straight answer, is what does that choice mean? What choice am I respecting? It looks like reproductive choice. Is that not what you're talking about? That is. That is what I'm talking about. Okay. I'm talking so about, you I'm respect a woman's choice. Access, well, choice to me is. I'm talking about access to, to health care, to take care of children, to take care of mothers, to take care of fathers and families. And Is one of those things. choices, is one of the choices you respect the, the yes. choice to kill a child like that? Yes. Okay, so so that at least we're on the same page. Say, Thank I'm you for being honest. These pictures, that these pictures are not accurate depictions of the vast majority of things that are even Can, legal, that are legal in this country. And that, like, that's actually a, a very common abortion practice is dilation and extraction. So, and they no, cut up the body and pull thing. it out. This is, this is the thing. Vacuum the, it out. The numbers that, and the sites that we go to are completely different. And I'm saying, I'm sure that you have done all the kind of research that you think is justified to get you to the to get your priest. Let's let's say that ba let's say that baby let's say that, say that baby came out completely whole without being cut up. It's still dead. I don't care. You could go in and give it a an, a, an Those a, a abortions shot. Abortions do not happen like that. It's just not. And where true. do you have that stat from? I have that stat from the like the. Um, you don't have that stat. You don't know what you're talking about. You're saying things. You're, you're saying things that you don't have any point to. You don't have any logic behind. You don't have any proof for. You're just saying this is how it is. That's proof. That's not Photoshop. That isn't a claymation doll. That's a real child. And it isn't. And if there's one like that, logic would dictate there's probably more than those like that. So that's right. That, that is the definition of a slippery slope. That, yeah. It, yeah. It can be. But I'm saying. That is. Yes, you're right. And that can be. A, but I'm saying, are you denying that? Do you think that's the only child that has been cut up like that in all the history of? Abortions. How many does it have to happen no, before it's okay? Drastic, the, that number is drastic. How many of those decreased? have to happen? That for number to be okay? is drastically decreased as funded and safe and healthy options have been provided for women, and their choice has been advocated socially. Okay. So, so those numbers have gone down. Okay. In, when just, you look just at okay. pro-choice, pro-choice presidencies, pro-choice congresses, pro-choice uh, like houses. The number of abortions go okay. down in this country. Okay, let's here's here's I could argue that stat all over the place, but let's not argue that stat. Let's just go with you've already answered it, but let's just be clear, and I, I'll stop bugging you. You believe that's okay for my, regardless of how many it is. That's okay. That's an that's an okay choice for a mother to do, for whatever reason she comes to it, rape, incest, whatever your reasoning is. It's okay to kill a child like that. You're okay with that. That is a choice you want to protect. I think it's unfortunate. But it's okay. I think that there are circumstances. I think you're making okay. this issue way the fuck more. Okay, tell me, black tell, you're tell me the. This into a dualistic no. argument. Tell me, of yes no. and no. Tell and me I the think incidents. That's a problem. Sure. Can you please tell me the incident when it's okay to kill a child like that? Can you give me the instance? No, because I'm not gonna be making that choice. I'm a dude. I'm saying that women need to have that so, choice, man. Like